Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Among the Stars Celebrity Perfume Reviews. And something telling me filming against the sun was not a smart idea. We're gonna, we're gonna fix this. Okay, so now we fix it. Now I'm not being like blinded by the sun. So anyway, it's been a really, really long time since I filmed a video. And I figured I would come on and do another video for you guys because it's been freaking forever. So as you can tell, I'm not in my normal location. I'm actually sitting on top of my roof. Um... Reasons I haven't been filming, one, life has just been crazy. Um, working two full-time jobs, as you guys know, at the beginning of November, I became a manager at Bath & Body Works, so I've been working full-time with that through the holidays, Black Friday, all that fun jazz. Um, plus, I'm still working full-time at the job I was working on before. Plus, on top of that, what time I do have, I'm either sleeping, or on top of that, I was also, um, we're in the midst of a remodel right now, and by remodel, I mean me and my husband are remodeling our attic space into making it our bedroom, and with that, it was like the storage space in our house, and so... With that, we had a like impromptu move everything out of that room so we could remodel it. So the perfume room actually became like the impromptu storage room. Uh, so that's that, I guess. I mean, it's really not something that's ideal, but for right now, it's where it's okay. Um, I'm actually I don't I set up filming on top of my rooftop. Right there is actually the window to what's going to be our new bedroom. Um, I may not film out here a whole lot. Um, I might, as the remodel is going on, I might do some reviews up here or whatever. Um, we'll see just what I'm allowed with time and work and all that fun jazz. Um, as you guys know, there is a new Viva La Juicy perfume called Viva La Juicy Rosé. I will be getting that relatively soon, thanks to my friend Lizzie. Um, link to her YouTube channel is down below. I also wanted to give a really quick shout out and thank you because I feel really, really bad that I didn't do it in my video. I want to give a huge thank you and shout out to my friend Jesse who got me um, Beyonce's Heat Kissed um, for my birthday. I did the review for that, but stupidly forgot to thank her in that. So thank you very much, Jesse, for getting me Beyonce's Heat Kiss for my birthday. Um, other new perfumes out are coming out relatively soon. You guys do know about, um, if you follow the line, um, Escada has already released their summer 2016 perfume, which is called Escada Agua del Sol. Um, it's actually a really, really pretty bottle. The notes sound really, really good. I can't wait to get a bottle of it myself to smell it. Um, other things that have happened recently, I hit a deer at the beginning of January, like second or third day as a manager, in management training, driving home from work, I hit a deer. Here's a picture of that. Let's just say I'm okay. I wasn't actually hurt in any way, shape, or form, but my poor baby had like $10,000 worth of damage to her, and I've only had it for like six months, so there's that. Um... Once my bedroom remodel gets completely done, I will do kind of like a video tour of our new bedroom once it's all done because I'm putting a lot of effort into this and my husband's putting a lot of effort into getting this done. I'm mostly on the design aspect of it and putting my cute little gay touches on it while he's putting his manly, manly work to work that I just can't do, such as building walls and patching holes and other shit that needs to be done in an attic to make it so it's not cold and drafty when we're trying to sleep. So anyway, um, the whole theme of the new room is actually black and gold. Um, I find black and gold very, like, chic and elegant, high class, and, like, just classy. So that's why I'm doing it that way. Plus, with, um, my work schedule and his work schedule, I like to sleep during the day when I'm not working, if I have time, um, because... Working my two full-time jobs, sometimes my time to sleep is from like 10 o'clock in the morning to like 4 o'clock in the afternoon, which I technically should be sleeping right now, but I'm filming a video for you guys because I haven't done one in forever. Um, other exciting news that I literally just found out about and I posted it on my Twitter and my Instagram. My fucking husband is amazing. Um, Kane Brown, who you guys know I've been obsessing about and telling you guys about since freaking forever, is coming to Sioux City here in Iowa, which it's a, quite a bit of a drive for me to get there, but 
to go see Kane and get to see him live in concert before he gets any bigger than he already freaking is. It's going to be amazing. Um, you guys know I've been supporting him and following him for years now. So, that's that. Um, other new stuff coming up. Once the perfume remodel, or once my bedroom remodel is done, I want to kind of do a little bit of a remodel on the perfume room. And I kind of want to give it a whole New York theme because New York's where a lot of perfume companies are based. And where a lot of the big launches end up going. And it's very, like, high-class, chic, elegant town. For the most part, on, like, the glamour side of it. I know that New York's not always that nice of a town. But, like... The picturesque view of it is it's a high-class glamorous town and that's where I kind of want to go with that theme it's all gonna be black white and like beige and gold um, not really black and gold because that's what my my bedroom is gonna be but this is gonna be more like creams with black touches and elegant stuff um, I found a really cool rug that I want to put in the room I got this really really cool idea for something that's gonna be a surprise if I can get it done that I want to show you guys um, and some other stuff. Black Friday was crazy. I worked Black Friday. I did get to do a little bit of a Black Friday haul. Um, I got 12 candles from work. Um, and I got three VIP totes, which came with, like, the Be Joyful set, the hand soap, and a Spice Apple Tidy candle. So, like, I got a total of 15 candles. Um, I only kind of, sort of, partly participated in the 850 candle sale, which really bums me out because I didn't get paid in time and what I mean it's okay like other things were more important um, for me to take care of so I bummed out on that I got two candles which I mean I got the two I really wanted which were two of the watermelon lemonades from the pop tails collection as you guys know that is like my favorite freaking candle from Bath and Body Works so there's that um I'm sorry if this whole video is at like a freaking angle. Like I'm trying to film on the roof and I tried to like balance out the video, but it just didn't work the way I wanted it to. So what else to tell you guys? Um, 2016, I might do a little bit different of a take on my channel. Um, not too sure what I want to do with it yet. I have some ideas and I'm going to keep them to myself until I finalize my ideas and then I'll tell you guys what they are once I start doing them. But I feel like 2016 should be a good time for me to start um, doing some more stuff. And one of the things I would like to do, if at all possible, is I'm going to try to do a vlog of when me, my husband, and my best friend go to see Kane. Um, just for the aspect, I think it'd be fun to do a vlog of that. So, not much else to tell you guys. Um, I'm always active on Twitter and Instagram and um, all my other social medias. Message me on there. I may not get back to you right away, but definitely please do message me and I will work my hardest to message you back when I possibly can. I'm not ignoring you guys. It literally just between working 40 hours a week at Bath and Body Works and 40 hours a week at my other job, I barely have time to think. So, um, but I am obviously kept keeping up on all the new perfume releases and everything like that. Um, haven't really bought a whole lot of new perfumes. I did get, like I said, the Vivo Juicy Rosé, thanks to my friend Lizzie. I got the Beyonce Heat Kiss, which I did a review of that you guys saw. Um, thanks to my friend Jesse. Um, I have some other videos I want to do, but I'm just debating on doing them out here or if I want to do them out in the perfume room once we get the remodel done. So hopefully with 2016, I'll have a new like new aspect to my channel. Plus I'll also have a steady video schedule, whether it be me filming a video at three o'clock in the morning on a Sunday night because that's the only time I can film or whatever it may be and just making it so they're uploading at the same time, same day on YouTube. that will be my best thing to do. So not really a whole lot. I mean. I can show you guys, like, on top of my roof, I guess. So, there's this house next door that they moved here, and I showed you, I think I showed you guys a video of them moving this house here. I was not very happy that they moved this house here, but I had no damn choice. And we got the back of my house, and all these houses around me. Like I said, this is kind of cool, because that's the window to the room. Um, that's all kind of messed up, because I crawled out of it. Um... And I'm just filming up here. So, there's that.
So anyway, guys, thanks so, so much for watching. I know this probably wasn't what you guys were hoping for, but I really wanted to kind of give you guys a life update and tell you what's been going on. So thanks so, so much for watching. As always, guys, follow me on Twitter, A to S Perfume, and Instagram, Among the Stars Perfume. Bye!